Hi Gary Bell, we're here at the NE6 Sweet and Walker for the dual contender. We're here with Amir Sabah. Sabasic, yes. Sabasic. Yeah. Um, can you tell us a little bit about the show, what's happening, who's on the show? Yeah, the, the, the show tonight was originally supposed to be a junior event, so we got a lot of applicants through, but we couldn't seem to match all the, all the fighters, Not, nothing uh, matched up correct, so we ended up doing it as more of an amateur, semi-pro sort of show. So now we've got some awesome fights on the card. We've got Caleb Johnson versus Amir's fighter. What's it? Yeah, Andrews. Andres Dumitro. So this should be a awesome fight. So yeah, who's your money? You didn't come end? all the way here to lose, obviously not. <laughs> long, long, long drive. <laughs> yeah, five hours. Thanks, yeah. Gary. <laughs> He's done it to me. Supposed in the past. to be my friend. Yeah. <laughs> then we've got uh, Justin Bermerton. He's fighting. Uh, got Jack Taylor. The fighter over there. He's fighting uh, Ian Ashbar. <laughs> Got another awesome fight. We've got Nathan Ransom uh, from my gym. He's fighting Christian Joplin from Jamie Bass Gym. I think you know Christian yourself with working with Jamie. Uh, we've got Robert Barry versus Paul Morris. That's another awesome fight. That's uh, the main event. Uh, pro fight that one. We would have had also uh, Nicola Bach from my gym against yeah, Nicole, Nicole Wood. Wood yeah. But she got hurt unfortunately. So, and, and that was going to be looking, for the title weren't Yeah, it? English title. We were so looking forward to it. But hopefully we'll uh, get that fight back on. It doesn't matter who's sure that fight yeah. on, whether it's on a me or mine. And the main, main thing is is that these girls deserve the title opportunity mm. and it, whichever show the fight on, whether yeah, it's... Yeah, Nicola is on a roll at the moment. She's, she won all the last seven fights. She stopped all the last three yeah. girls. So, and so Nic she's Nicole Wood's the, the same, same as well. Yeah, so so both uh, top top girls well, in uh, England, yeah. yeah. So th this fight needs to happen. So are you it probably, will. Yeah. When, is, when is your next event? Uh, 12th of November, Super Fight so, Series. Uh, yeah. 4th, 12th of November. 12th of November in London? St Albans, <laughs> St Albans Arena, the same place. So yeah, like this one. We just yeah. obviously, right now I'm just, you know, working on yeah. getting him and all out of hospital and everything and then to be honest, everything else is sorted. It's just yeah, like, yeah. I matched nearly over eighty percent of the card already. Right. And also, I've got a uh, contender promotions uh, coming up. That's in November. Also, the date I think it shoots the eighteenth of November. Uh, I'm going to be having two world title fights on that card. All to be announced soon. There's something special that nobody's ever done before. So contender promotions. Good. They're going to show a super fight series up. <laughs> <laughs> no, working we'll together, that's the we'll key, that's working yeah. together is the key, so, and uh, like I say, all fighters from all over the country or anywhere, they deserve to fight on, on, on top shows, like this, this one's only like a small event tonight that me and David are doing, but still we've got some good fighters on, there's some good fighters coming through the ranks who are on this show, and I mean, you'll probably scout a few tonight, maybe you want opportunities to fight on each show 100%. or whatever, same, I'll be wanting them to fight on the contender promotion show on the same, David, with these uh, dual We like the good old battle of North versus yeah. South, yeah. So Let's get it on. The best fighters, best contender promotions and dual fighters versus super fight series. Big arena, all fighters, stay fans tuned. coming over, stay Maybe tuned. close coming. by here, yes. Yeah. I heard there's a nice round uh, dome. Yeah. Like It'll be like all roads lead to Newcastle Dome. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? So it could be happening, guys. So yeah, World World Fighting League, that's uh, something I'm working on with uh, Melvin Manoff. So at the minute we're just waiting on finalising the contracts and uh, to make sure everything's in place properly for not just me, for the fighters and obviously the WFL team itself so we can take it like further with obviously me will have guys from me I know but obviously uh, David and other top gyms around the UK I'll be looking to be contacting them to get them on this card. Yeah it's quite good because all of us have someone and you know yeah. obviously we have two Chinese shows and, and Super Combat as well yeah. through SFS and through Duel and all of us collaborating together just as I always used to say, I'm just like sick seeing smaller countries having huge shows. Yeah, and it needs to happen in now. Yeah, I, I think I, it is getting better though. NK1 in, as yeah. well, so yeah. I've seen a, a massive difference soon. over the last few years yes. in their uh, fight shows. They are, they are getting more and more, more popular. Come here, David, don't hide. He's David. <laughs> Come on, Dave, how are we getting there? <laughs> Get in here. Get in. <laughs> We're here with Dave, oh. David Wield also. Tell, tell a bit about the show, Dave. Um, well, it's a bit of a funny one, really. We started off as a junior show. We had about 60, 70 fighters, but none of them were just matching up with each other. So about five weeks out, we said, let's make it a proper show. So mm. we've got 20 fights, seven juniors, and the rest are seniors. Uh, yeah, it's a good mix. Amateur K1, K1 light, and then pro K1. Yeah, some, there's some good fights on in there, so... Yeah, we have got some, some uh, 
We've got Robbie Barry versus Paul Morris yeah, Jr. Event. The main event that will be a cracker. Two really good upcoming local lads. And uh, you've got like Nathan Ransom versus uh, Christian Joplin. That's another tough fight. To be honest. Yeah, it's, it's an interesting one. That, yeah. It'd be a, be a big win for Nathan as well. Obviously, he is stepping up. Uh, Joplin's up there in the rankings, but I believe I've trained there for myself, and I believe uh, the kid's got some some talent, and I think could be uh, within an upset tonight. So it's the main thing they get yeah. the chances to fight. Yeah, they have to. You have to take the chances, chances in this yeah. game, don't you? That's the thing. So don't don't and hold yourself back as a fighter because nah. it's a short short shelf life, I would say. That's it as well. Um, Christian Joplin coming from the Massac gym. Really noted for the kicking as well. And the last time he was on duel, he scored a head kick knockout against David Ends from Scotland. That won't happen tonight. So, that'll not happen tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Look, we're going to bet, let's bet. Yeah. Let's no betting, bed. no betting, no right. betting, no drinking. <laughs> head kick knockout. <laughs> head kick knockout, both years. Grand each. Yeah. 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 Grand each, I'll go okay. to Joplin 500. Aye. Aye. <laughs> I'll go to bed. 10 grand if he's with <laughs> It's um it's absolutely great seeing three <coughs> promoters come together and producing this show. Like how do you all feel about these all coming together and producing a yeah, show? Yeah, we, 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 we sort of just mentioned it there. That it, if if to be honest, if the fighters, if we can get all the best fighters who fight on all of our shows, and we can find a proper location and everything comes together and all the fans and fighters get behind it it's something that we could be willing to do but it costs a shitload of money to put a massive show on the way it would have to be if we all come together to do it yeah. so we couldn't just stick a massive show in here it just no. needs sponsors and promote uh, yeah. actually it needs support it's more or less support well, that's it yeah i mean I, I think the three of us we're all part of the wka as well um, that helps too yes yeah obviously i mean as mm. wka head of the european division uh, me and Gary run North East and right. you know we, we are trying to collaborate as best we can help each other out as Gary says if we can all come together on exchange a details, basis. exchange knowledge yes of yeah. course you know I, I mean has to be right for everyone I yeah. saw a good venue today so you know we uh, Paul Paltich my business partner for Super Fight Series and I we were thinking of um, well we, were, we are increasing the SFS shows next year and uh, not yet to be disclosed, but I don't see a reason why we should not come up to the north and to the south and west and east and abroad and so on and so on. It's all ready, it's just like the right timing. We don't want to really rush, I think. Yeah. You know, no need yeah. to run before you can stand. Or, eh? No, it's yeah. exactly right, yeah. Yeah. Support the shows, yeah. be there, don't just talk about it. Everyone spends on a weekend like... 50 under pounds and you know your guys your friends are fighting they they the yeah, yeah, old sure, coaches yeah, as yeah. well they all train hard you know a lot of them get injured and they really really train hard do the best and it's so nice coming out with at least 20 people mm -hmm. to shout at you not some guys you know like they have 200 friends and yet no one can come I don't really call them friends for me that's not friendship is it yeah I think uh, what, what would help fight shows is uh, if a lot more fighters from actual gyms supported other shows as well because without fans we sort of haven't got a sport and if these guys are training in the gym all the time this is their sport so without them su su uh, supporting uh, the main shows especially I would say it, mm. it, it makes things a little bit harder but if you can get these fighters behind it a bit more as well as the family and friends and general fans that come I think the sport will grow massively you'll see a massive change in it if that did happen well thank you as well Brilliant. for media coverage yeah. such as yours it's quite nice to have contender promotions yes. number one yes <laughs> slightly behind you we don't really care, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> We're not competing. We do our own thing. Contender number one, see you later. We work yeah, with everyone. In Middlesbrough. <laughs> in the world. Coming to the north.